In this video, I will show you how to go back to Windows 11 24H2 from Windows 11 25H2 without losing any data or reinstalling Windows. The first way is if you upgraded using an enablement package or Windows update. You can uninstall that update package to go back to Windows 11 24H2. First, go to the Windows Update option. Select Update History. Scroll down. Under Related Settings, select Uninstall Updates. Uninstall the feature update for Windows 25H2 with the update ID KB5054156. Once that is done, restart your computer. As you can see, your computer has been downgraded from Windows 11 25H2 to 24H2. All your data and installed apps are still here. The second way is if you upgraded using the Windows 11 Installation Assistant. To go back, you will need to use the Recovery feature in Windows. In Windows Settings, select System. Scroll down and select Recovery. You will see a Go Back button to return to the version you had before upgrading. However, there are two conditions you must meet to be able to go back. The first condition is that you must go back within 10 days of upgrading. The second condition is that the Windows.old folder on your C drive must not be deleted. Normally, that folder will be deleted automatically after 10 days. That's why you must go back within 10 days of the upgrade. If these conditions are not met, the Go Back button will be grayed out. As you can see, Windows has been reverted to the previous version from Windows 11 25H2. That's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you in the next videos.